everyone, Rachel Jensen here, broker owner of Luna Realty Belize in the beautiful country of Belize. We are here right now at Aruna Resort and Villas located on the west side of Ambergris Key. A quick five minute boat ride across the lagoon from the heart of San Pedro town or a quick 15 minute golf cart ride to the very popular Seagirt Beach. We're gonna be updating you on what has happened here on site over the last month. These are the June updates, a lot to see. As many of you know, if you've been following, we are doing a soft opening of the property the end of July. Behind me, you'll probably be seeing some of the restaurant staff. They are here in training, preparing for the restaurant to open. So let's take a quick look around, see what's happened out here in the primary area where we have the pool, the restaurant, and then also the outdoor bar. And then we'll take a look at seeing what's happening within phase one as that's nearing for that soft opening the end of July, and then take a look at the construction in phase two. All right, let's get going, guys. All right, behind me, you'll see some new furniture that has arrived for the lounging decks. They do have mattresses as well that will go in once the property is opened here. And then what they're also planning on doing is adding ladders down into the water so it's easy to get back up once you jump in and enjoy the water over here. So you'll see more of this type of furniture throughout. A lot of the, the furniture has been sourced from Mexico and having that Tulum inspired feel to it. So you'll see a lot of that throughout the property here. All right, we are in front of one of the duplexes that is currently under construction. This is in phase one. There is another duplex next to us as well. We're going to take a look into it. This is not actually listed on the site map as available. These models, well, these two are already sold, but this model is not listed as available. But if you are interested in it, do let us know. We are able to get you more information and then put in a future phase three. So we're going to walk up so you can see what the duplex looks like. But I do want to note upstairs, you can see the, the steel framing up there. Both of these owners have decided to do a rooftop terrace so there are custom options for you if you decide to come in pre-construction so let's go take a look around the area that we're in right here this is one of the bedrooms behind me there is an area for a closet also a little kitchenette and then the bathroom now what this owner is going to be doing as well as adding an outdoor kitchen right over here so he's going to have that additional space and then you'll see the stairs that go up here they'll be the first tier which is where he's adding a wet bar and then the tier above, which is where there'll be more lounge space. So this can be rented all together or it can be rented just this side over here with the Ecuador kitchen or it can be rented with the other side, which is a studio as well. That studio does not have an outdoor kitchen and won't have access to this one, but that one is a little bit smaller in size as well. So again, can be rented all together, which is what we're seeing people are book for, booking for already, or it could be rented out individually, just depending on what that renter is looking for. All right, well, guess who I ran into here while on site at Aruna, and it is Peter. Peter is the project manager for this property here, and I'm going to ask Peter to tell us a little bit more about the construction methodology. Why I like this home right now as it is is because we're seeing it at a various, stage, various stages of construction. So, Peter, I'm going to hand the mic to you if you don't, don't mind sharing with the group here a sure. little bit more about the construction. Yeah, I'd be happy to. Hi, everyone. Peter Garion here. And um, what we have here with these new units. So the, the other units are wood. Mm -hmm. These units now are a steel frame. It's a galvanized steel. And then what we do is we have these what are called SIP panels. Mm -hmm. SIP stands for structurally insulated panel. Mm -hmm. And what it is, is it's a, uh, it's a foam insulation, a styrofoam insulation, and it's reinforced with uh, a steel mesh, a steel mm -hmm. framing. And then it's put into place with other steel and rebar. And then what we do is we cast it with concrete. We apply forms and then we pour it into a concrete cast. And so you have these structurally insulated walls and concrete walls that are very secure, very, uh, very strong, very resistant to high winds and hurricanes and everything. So it's a, it's a very good product. It's a high quality product and it provides a lot of wind resistance and a lot of, uh, good um, structural integrity as well. Right. Mm -hmm. and, and that is important now too, because um, if you're listening to this, this is the June update, but we're here in July 1st, which is when we do have a, a predicted storm coming our way. So it's nice to see that the construction methodology here is built to hurricane standards, is, yeah. right? And then also just for folks to be able to see the different parts of where it's at in construction. Mm -hmm. So anything yeah. else, Peter, you'd like to add about the construction? Uh, no, just that it's, uh, it's coming along. So um, we're finally starting to hit our stride a little bit now. And so um, we've got some good systems in place. We've got the right teams in place now and uh, all our materials are here. And so we're really making some good progress now. And so I think over the next few weeks and months, we're really gonna see some, uh, some really good updates coming from, uh, from Rachel and the team here. So it's exciting to see. 
Perfect. Well, thank you so much. And for anyone listening, Mike, this is your home. Andrea and Dexter will go into yours next, just so you can see some of the updates about what's happening here. And thank you for all of your work that you've been doing and making sure the project is moving forward. Absolutely. Thank you. Good to see you, Rachel. And behind me, we have Andrea and Dexter's house, and they also decided to go with the duplex model. For those of you who are looking at investment opportunities here on the island, if you're looking at a duplex, that means two times the opportunity for rental income. So this could be a great model for you. And again, they also like the first uh, one that we walked through, Mike's home, they also decided to do a rooftop terrace. I know they're going to be adding some more customizations like a hot tub up there. So imagine being on the second floor, looking right out at the lagoon and enjoying the water views right there from your hot tub on a chillier evening here in Belize. We are here in phase two right now. The primary focus has been getting phase one complete as we do have that soft opening coming up. But here in phase two, they have laid piping for the septic, for water, and then also for electricity to br be brought out to the homes. Do remember in the larger models, the two and the three bedroom models, there is going to be solar that is included. Uh, there are no battery systems, so it's primarily going to be used during the day. But if you do want to add batteries, of course, you can you can do that too but nice for folks to have hybrid systems if it is something that is important to you as you can see there's a lot of movement pushing to get phase one done for this soft opening we know that the restaurant is getting ready for its big opening as well and we are making headway on phase two and then also phase three will be starting soon for those of you who are not aware of the construction obviously you heard a little bit more about peter talking about it and that prefab steel gets all cut in a factory so we're putting the order in this summer it'll take a few months to get here They're going to be starting on the foundation work in the next few weeks as well so we're excited about that and then when the material arrives the homes will be able to go up so stay tuned lots of exciting stuff coming and i encourage you to reach out if you are interested in ownership of property here we do have properties starting at about two hundred thirty thousand dollars us and there is seller financing available too so reach out to us we'd love to hear from you and in the meantime have a great day